Hey guys, I get a lot of questions if uh, Nervous Network has a mobile wallet, and yes they do. It's super simple. All we're going to do is use MetaMask, uh, download the MetaMask app, and use its web browser to access ckb.pw. And that's all there is to it. So let's go and get started and um, to show you how easy it really is. Just going to look up MetaMask. There it is. I'm going to download that. We're going to open that. Go ahead and click at the bottom, get started. And we're going to create a new wallet. Let's click on the blue button here. It's going to click no thanks to all this here. Go ahead and put in a password. Let's go ahead and click create a password. And here it's going to ask for your secret recovery phrase. Do this. Um, you'll be glad you did later on. Don't take a screenshot of the keywords. Actually write them down and put these in a safe place. So let's go ahead and click start. Click start again. And we're going to put in the password we just put in a while ago, my, which mine was Nervos Jedi123. And right here, we're going to reveal our secret recovery phrase. Let's click view. And again, these 12 words, write them down, put them in a safe place. We're just going to click continue. It's going to ask for these words again. So just click on the first word, which the first word was lecture. And once you put those words in, go ahead and complete back up. And that's it. We're just going to click done. And again, like I said earlier, the only reason we're using MetaMask, we're just going to use MetaMask's uh, browser. If you click browser right here just above wallet, we're going to type in the address ckb.pw. And, and the PW just stands for portal wallet. Click on that. It'll take a second. It's asking us to connect to the site. Go ahead and click on the bottom right hand corner here, connect. And that's it. At this point here, we can click on CKB here above the one the word that says DAO. So click on CKB. And you can receive and send your CKB with this wallet at this point. So when we click receive, it gives you an Ethereum address and a CKB address. Now the Ethereum address is, say if you have friends or whoever wants to use their portal wallet to send you CKB, they use this address. But if somebody's gonna send you crypto or CKB from like crypto.com, they're gonna send it to this address right here, the CKB address, the full address. So again, the difference is the Ethereum address, if it's somebody sending from another portal wallet, or you can just be safe and always just use the regular CKB address like I always do. So I can click back at the very bottom left hand corner. And if you go up to the top left up here at the uh, colorful, colorful circle, let's click on that. It just, again, it's just a drop down of the Ethereum address and the CKB address. So, of course, you can click on uh, copy right here to copy the address if you want to send it to someone or you can scan the QR code and you notice down here at the bottom there's one that says DAO D-A-O if let's click on that this is the way we can stake your CKB pretty self-explanatory really let's click on that let's hit connect and at this point uh, you need to have some CKB sent to this wallet and all you would do is just type in where it says a thousand right here or how much you have in your balance, you just click deposit, and there you've staked your CKB. And that's all there is to it um, with this mobile wallet. So basically, in essence, you're just using MetaMask at, for its web browser 
to go to ckb.pw. And that's all there is to it. You do those couple things, you, uh, you have a uh, CKB wallet in no time. So that's it for today, guys. If you have any suggestions, um, comments, let me know. I'll be making a lot more videos down the road for the uh, CKB project. Thanks so much.